right now uh, we're on the Washington Channel, a uh, body of water I, I've sailed um, once in. <laughs> I got my uh, parrot. Uh, I have my accordion. First of all, uh, I'd like to welcome everybody aboard the Ardell. It's, it's uh, been really great working with everybody here and being part of this event. Um, as uh, most of you probably know, we sailed a little over 600 miles to get here, um, down from Massachusetts. And um, this is the schooner Ardell. She's a representation of what we call a pinky schooner, which was uh, early form of fishing boat uh, that was used, developed in Essex and used along the New England coast. There's two kind of remarkable things about the construction. First of all, the boat was built uh, almost entirely of recycled materials. And we love the term recycled because it makes us appear uh, green and not just cheap, desperate. <laughs> but, um, if you look around the boat, all of the standing and running rigging um, and the spars and a lot of the ironwork and the windlass and the engine and a lot of the gear on the boat, the hatches, uh, was salvaged from other boats that we had. So the woods that are used in the boat are very similar to the woods that would have been used a couple hundred years ago. I like to enter a city if if I can from the water and um, coming up to the city is an interesting, offers an interesting perspective and I had been to uh, Washington DC by uh, mostly by train and automobile and um, I'd heard about the Potomac River and heard Washington DC was really a, a swamp but it, when you come up the Potomac River it's, uh, it's a fairly deep and wide river um, coming up through Chesapeake Bay and uh, uh, compared to where I'm from, it's really uh, it's a it's a beautiful port. Uh, what was really uh, great about building this boat was um, the fact that um, this boat, to me, proved that we really had um, preserved the traditions and the culture and the techniques. And there was a lot of young people involved, uh, young and old, in this boat. Um, some of the people were, uh, you know, school age, so they could they had more time, and others were older retired guys who had more time to contribute to a, you know, a, a non-paying job, and and uh, how well the different generations worked together and and learned from each other was uh, it was really uh, it was really great. Too bad you can't see the Washington Monument back there. Well, you can put it in, I'm sure. <laughs>